said, good evening. Good evening. All right. I want y'all to talk to me when I talk to you. At any rate, I'm here to celebrate with you the induction of a young man that I've known. I usually would say more years than we want to admit. <laughs> we were teenagers when we first looked at each other's eyes. He was doing demonstration records and also running around to publishers and record companies trying to introduce songs that were being written by songwriters. I was also doing demonstration records, but I wasn't trying to sell any records. That was not my gig. I was just singing them and hoping that the composers that wrote those particular songs were able to get them to the persons that they wanted to sing them. We practically lived in the infamous Brill Building, mm -hmm. where every publisher that you've ever heard a recording or saw a piece of music from housed themselves. Many hats he has worn in his ongoing career and may end with, well, it hasn't ended yet. He's still capturing people's minds and hearts. It's the kind of guy he happens to be. So it is with my pleasure that we first of all take a look at something called film. <laughs> Davis in talent management. He then formed Tony Orlando and Dawn, Telma Hopkins, and Joyce Vincent. The group had 19 top 40 tracks, including Tie a Yellow Ribbon Round the Old Oak Tree, one of the biggest selling singles of all time, followed by a primetime network hit CBS television variety show. Five times Entertainer of the Year in Las Vegas, four times Atlantic City, he was the 2018 International Casino Entertainer of the Year. A staunch supporter of veterans forever to this day was presented with the Lee Greenwood Patriot Award. Currently, Tony hosts Saturday Nights with Tony Orlando on the iconic Music Radio 77 WABC, number one in New York, New Jersey. Celebrating a remarkable, still active 63rd year in the entertainment industry. Performer, producer, entertainer extraordinaire across all platforms. We also have a very, very special message from someone that is a true legend and great friend of both of us. Here's Clive Davis. What a terrific night. First, I'd like to personally congratulate all the inductees, especially my friends, Patty Scalfa, Kiki Bomber, and Tony Orlando. I'm here on deck tonight to induct the very special artist, as well as being my personal friend. Tony Orlando. Simply put, Tony is one of a kind. Several songs he recorded will they become all-time classics, like Candida, Not Three Times, Say Has Anybody Seen My Sweet Gypsy Rose, He Don't Love You Like I Love You, and of course, the biggest of them all, Tie a Yellow Ribbon Round the Old Oak Tree. Tony worked for me as a successful music publishing executive before he became an artist. I knew him as special then, and the whole world knew him as special in all the years that have followed. 
So it really is with great personal pleasure that I induct Tony Orlando into the New Jersey Hall of Fame. Tonight is the culmination of a dream for me. In the very cities that I lived in, Union City, then North Bergen, then Fort Lee, then finally Hasbro Heights, New Jersey. I came here when I was 12. I moved over to LA to do my television show with Telma Hopkins and Joyce Vincent Wilson. Maybe you remember us, we're called Tony Orlando. <laughs> Jenny Rose, my son John. They have given me such support through the years, it's unimaginable, and I want to thank them. Put yourself in my shoes tonight. This is a heavy place to be right now. This is a major lifetime moment, and you guys have made a welcoming already that's a dream come true. Thank you for that. I also want to thank Danny DeVito's cousin, that's right, Johnny Patillo. From Asbury Park, he's been my stage mate for 32 years. Johnny, thank you for that. And I know I'm supposed to make this a short one. I understand, but put yourself in my shoes. How do you make 64 years thank you to you, the people, who make the dreams possible. How do you do it in two and a half minutes? This is all I can say to you. I am now humbled, and I am now forever grateful to all of you, the troopers, my fan club who's out there, all of you out there who've given me 64 years of a dream come true. Honest to God, I can never be paid. And honest to God, I will miss you. Five 
years of management, and I think, and I hope I've mentioned to everybody here tonight, John, my son, my daughter Jenny, my beautiful, incredible wife, Franny, thank you for putting up with me and supporting me like this. And to all of you, I swear to good God in heaven, thank you and I love you all. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, Danny DeVito. 